this is what we resort to technology so this truck has cameras looking down the side and back of the truck then you have a satellite view looking down at the truck then you got that box right there behind it that's a self-driving box good everybody lockout man back again with another fresh internet reaction video thank you for hitting that play button i really do appreciate you guys supporting the content that i am bringing to you guys entertaining education whatever the case trucking videos life whatever i appreciate everything that you guys are doing if you like it hit that like button make sure it turns blue because it's free and it does what it's supposed to do. Today's video, too much is going on in this video. Too much. Well, not the video per se, but it's too much going on inside the truck. It really is. Too much technology. Now I get the technology now that we have to adapt to it. You know, we, we adapt to the bandit system that, that if we cross the line, it said beep, 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 let you know if you too close to a car, beep, 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 beep let you know. Uh, and in some cases, if you're, if you're driving in cruise or anything like that, and you get too close to a car, it, the, the, the truck itself will disengage the cruise and engage the brake to slow you down all in the name of safety. Everything, everything that, that's, that's, that's conducive to the truck, everything from the driver cam to the bandit system to the captive braking is all in the name of of safety now don't get me wrong safety is important safety is number one safety should always be on your mind when you're driving this truck 24 7 11 hours 14 hours whatever safety 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 is the key this is what we resort to technology all right no being distracted no not having your seatbelt on, being focused on the road, making sure that you are safe as long as you're driving safe around the people. But technology, man, technology today, too much, too much. And in this video right here, we got, we got mirror cameras inside the truck. We got, we got, the left mirror camera on the left, the right mirror camera on the right. We got the we got the dash. We got the uh, dr uh, the driver cam as well as the automatic bots that pretty much automates the truck. You also have a back uh, a backup cam as well. Is this too much for you, or would you like it? This is what we resort to technology. So this truck has cameras looking down the side and back of the truck then you have a satellite view looking down at the truck then you got that box right there behind it that's a self-driving box so this truck can actually drive itself once i hit the cruise control the only thing it won't do is a left turn or right turn but it'll go down the interstate speed up slow down and it will stay in the lane and then i have a camera over there doing as I ain't dying. What you think? Oh, that's my camera right there that watches the road and watches uh, me as well. So if I'm in an accident, the, you know, the company can defend themselves. But it would, but at what cost? You already got your mirrors. So what is the point of the mirror cameras? If you got your mirrors, don't listen here. Don't dumb down the truck all right don't dumb down the driver with the driver spent over well over thousands of dollars to get his cdl only to get dumbed down by technology this is what we resort to technology 
Now, leave it to the old schoolers, they'll say, uh, the dumb down started when the trucks turned to automatics, turned to automatics. Okay. We, 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 we got used to that. We got used to it. But now they're, they're dumbing it down more by putting mirror cameras inside of the truck. Now, I understand if now if they didn't have that kind of set up that way and they just had the, the, the outside cameras pointing down the side and the rear camera. And then it is like a little a little box display on the on the heads up dashboard. Then, yeah, I'm good with that. Because you can see you 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 got a camera that's on the left, a camera that's on the right, but that's watching you from any accidents or anything like that. But you got mirror cameras inside the truck, and I I I I don't know. This is what we resort to. Technology. So this truck has cameras looking down the side and back of the truck then you have a satellite view looking down at the truck then you got that box right there behind it that's a self-driving box so this truck can actually drive itself once i hit the cruise control the only thing it won't do is a left turn or right turn but it'll go down the interstate speed up slow down and it will stay in the lane i don't know i mean if i work for sais then of course i'm gonna have to be subjected to their trucks their policies or whatever whatever but uh <laughs> is that too much for you though let me know in the comments below all right that's gonna do it for me lockout men i really do appreciate it you guys like it hit that like button for me it works it does what it's supposed to do and it's free and when it turns blue that's a good thing all right that lets me know that you're rocking with me the more likes i get it helps the channel pretty much i bring guys guys i bring you not only trucking content but i bring you reaction videos and try to give you something at the entertainment you have any videos links or anything like that send them over to me i'll watch it react to it and i'll bring it out for you guys entertainment until next time everybody y'all take it easy and i'll come back at you with another one peace this is what we resort to technology so this truck has cameras looking down the side and back of the truck then you have a satellite view looking down at the truck then you got that box right there behind it that's a self-driving box so this truck can actually drive itself once i hit the cruise control the only thing it won't do is a left turn or right turn but it'll go down the interstate speed up slow down and it will stay in the lane and then I have a camera over there doing a Zion Dine. What you think? Oh, that's my camera right there that watches the road and watches uh, me as well. So if I'm in an accident, you know, the company can defend themselves.